Hello there, dear YouTubers. My name is King1993, and today I'll be talking about the dorm shop. Now, before talking about the dorm shop, let's uh, do this explanation as fast as possible, and I'll be making it into two parts. The first part I will be talking about what you can get from there, and in the second part I'll be talking about how you might want to decorate your room. Okay? So first of all, let's get started. Let's select this dorm sorry uh, i mean this dorm here it is now your primary target in this part of the gameplay is to increase your comfort level as much as possible if you increase the comfort level you will get onigiri now how can you increase the comfort level you can increase the comfort level by going to this blueprint and then buying this certain type of materials the more materials you have in your inventory the more comfort level will increase and the more comfort level which increase the more the dorm update you will be able to make now what is the maximum dorm update level the maximum dorm update level is level 10 mine is at level 6 in this place and in Saint Freya in in the beach my uh, level my level is level 6 and in the Saint Freya dorms it is level 9 okay as you can see here 9 the more the dorm level is the more comfort you are gonna get and the more uh, of this material you have in your inventory the more comfortable which you are gonna get now once what will happen if you get the high comfort level obviously onigiri now the question is where can you use this onigiri you can use those onigiri in the errands okay if you go and select this icon here you will see that the errands basically gives you these items now out of all of these items this item is called work point item and in the work point item if you get enough points of them then what will happen is you will be able to use those work point item and go to this dorm shop and in the dorm shop okay let me show you again this is the dorm shop and once you enter the dorm shop these are the materials which you are gonna get you are gonna get two uh, crystal arm from this place you are gonna get 99 face shifter from this place uh, Einstein Taurus 50 of them and AC metal uh, 99 of them now do remember that these three materials are highly important for your 5 star weapon to become a 6 star weapon whereas these eggs these eggs basically have cards in them okay now different uh, uh, eggs will have different type of cards in them and different cards will basically means that different type of Valkyrie character which you are gonna be able to get okay now here is another thing that this is called advanced skill material some Valkyrie characters definitely need this material in order for you to unlock their skill and this is definitely an important item which you are gonna get and last but not least this is the drum supply card you're gonna get about five drum supply card per month out of those far five drum supply card per month three of them are gonna be available from this dorm shop so if you get enough of them let's say 10 of them in two months then you will be able to do a 10 pool you'll be able to do a 10 pool on this dorm supply and this dorm supply basically give you a lot of free Valkyrie characters as uh, they get older okay basically speaking this uh, black nucleus bronia or the celestial him or this stygian nymph they are more than one years old so as a result they are now free to play characters okay now this is basically the definition of why you should be trying to get the dom supply card okay now here is the second part of this video in the first part of the video i have talked about how you can get those work point cards and where can you spend those work point cards okay now here is the second part of the video in this second part of the video i'll be talking about why you should be decorating your room now do remember that this is a multi type of game there are multi aspect to this game and one of them is this dorm supply sorry uh, one of them is this dorm room and the benefit of this dorm room is you are able to interact with the character uh, and also at the same time you can decorate their room now truth to be told i have decorated their room as minimalistic as possible because th that is basically how I actually would have done decorating my room okay so the room which I have decorated in the way which you are currently seeing right now is definitely something which I had 
uh, done it in my room if i were to have any type of materials okay so this is basically a reflection of what i would uh, how i would decorate my room now in case if you do not like the decoration of the room in this manner then you can definitely go to some other places as well to look at their decorations for example this is the visit option this is the visit option if you click on this visit option you will be able to go to some other places so let's uh, go to this person place it is level 10 and in this place as you can see here it is decorated in this following manner and the decoration here is not actually bad it is okay but it is not organized okay for example th that is a door the, this place is a door and in front of the door is this fridge so obviously it is not organized but this room is highly organized in such a way that one can even say this is a playroom for the characters okay and for some reason this guy has put all of the Himaka character in this one room okay but otherwise this room actually looks better than mine now if you do not like this example you can go to another pl person's place for example this another person would be like this uh, Rushidai whoever it is he, is he or she is so this is a messy room as you can probably see here what this person did was basically put as much as material here as possible and the comfort level of this guy is over 4000 but other than that this place doesn't look a bit uh, comfort level comforting at all and because this uh, place doesn't look comforting at all i would highly suggest that you do not try to uh, make this place look uh, this messy okay now another uh, person i want to visit let's say for this one this one is even though it is done with the cheap material at least the organized pattern of this room is better okay i highly suggest uh, this organization room but the thing is the materials which has been put here is a low quality material which is why the comfort level is low okay here it is this is my character yep the room is organized very well but the only problem is that the room uh, contains low quality material which is why the comfort level is low so let's say you want to spend a bit more time here then please do so because if you want to play this game and do not uh, put a bit of effort into this place then eventually you, you might feel like that you are missing uh, some part of it and that is the reason why i am decorating it now now why am i decorating it now because at the beginning part this was not that much essential like you would not get essential material out of those dawn supply cards oh, so, sorry not work supply card okay but eventually they made work supply card in such a way that if you have those work supply card you will be able to get a lot more material so in that regards it is better than before this is uh, my beach resort too. and this in this beach resort i basically did this uh, matrix i put two doors here okay it looks minimal minimalistic okay and this one as well this one is not fully decorated yet to remember that all of this place is not fully decorated yet because i do need to uh, collect uh, what should i call this this honkai cube and each time i collect this honkai cube i must need to get it from the mithril shop okay now how much do i get i get about uh, 99 of them now do remember that in 5.1 this mithril is gonna be converted into coins so if you are planning on using uh, this uh, honkai cube or honkai blocks whatever it is as much as you want you can still be able to get them but not with this material anymore rather with coins and this game provides a lot of coin okay how much coin does it provide uh, about a few weeks ago i actually had 100 million coins in this 
place i actually had 100 million coins so for me to have 100 million coins is a lot and eventually i actually had to use it on something which i didn't actually had to buy okay so that that much amount of coins you are gonna get so you will have a chance to get those sonkai cube 99 of them on a regular basis and if you were to get that much amount of one kk on a regular basis then what will happen is your term uh, uh, comfort level will definitely increase as well since i have just bought a lot of them let me give you another demonstration let's say i want to fill up this room because this room actually looks very empty so i go to this blueprint and then select the jet pavilion now once i've selected the jet pavilion there are many items which i can get and in case if i have uh, let's say one of them it means i have already put them in one places and i need to buy another so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna buy a few of them for example i need to buy one shelf i need to buy one jet sofa or jet chair and buy um, one of these mat okay okay i have few more jet ornament okay so i have bought enough material so right now my the honkai blocks is at 34 so i'm gonna have to wait for tomorrow so whatever i have let, let me put it here let's go to this edit edit and then select this filter and then select this jet pavilion and once i have done that uh, i can do it in the following manner for example i'm gonna put this here so whenever someone enters uh, that person is gonna be able to see this carpet Ah, uh, okay let me rotate it rotate it okay and then i'm gonna put this jade ornament now this jade ornament is basically a wall material so you have to put it on the wall what does it do i have no idea okay i'm not gonna put it there i'm gonna put it on this place okay here yeah. okay good. this looks good and now there is this jet sofa or this jet chair I'm gonna put it on fr in front of the TV. Why? Be uh, let me show you. Okay. Okay. And finally, this shelf. I'm gonna put the shelf uh, in in this place. Okay. 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 Good. And now, once I've uh, done putting all of these materials here, I'm gonna click on this save and exit and this is basically what it looks like now it was 3355 now it is 3448 so obviously the number increased and in case you are wondering why did i put it in this manner the sofa in front of the tv it gives uh, something like this type of sense that when there are a lot of people some people sit on the floor and some people sit on the sofa so in that manner I had actually put this sofa in front of this uh, TV. Now, as I get more Honkai cubes every day, I'm gonna put more of these materials in the room and will eventually increase my comfort level day by day. Uh, for this demonstration, I ha had not bought the Honkai cube for a few hours. Now, I have eventually bought them, and as you can see, I have decorated the room a bit more. And another uh, few more materials is gonna be added.
Yep. Now this looks better. Okay. Okay. So this is basically it. So as you probably see, this is basically how I decorate the room, and my decorating room is basically like I at least try to get one material, one material out of those set. Uh, out, uh, I try to get every material from those set in order to make sure that my dorm room actually looks better than the other people's okay so anyway this is it for today thank you for watching my videos please like and subscribe and click the bell notification icons otherwise youtube will not recommend my content to other people's as well okay thank you